Hey guys, uh, I'm here, you're there, let's do this. Uh, this is a response, not really a debunking or anything bad, just a response to Survival Lily. Um, I just saw a video that she posted about a week ago um, about batteries for, you know, or lights, you know, if the power goes out, what kind of lights would you hang on? Let's go back to my computer here. Um, the title of the video is what lanterns are best on Amazon? Question mark. Blackout preparation exclamation point. So, uh, and in this video, she went through a bunch of lanterns. She got off of Amazon and uh, with varying degrees of success. So, um, I wanted to show you, this is my backpack. I carry this every day. This is my EDC, I guess. Um, and in my EDC, let me set this up here. I carry a battery backup for my cell phone and my Kindle. And I carry these. Over here, we can set this down, maybe. All right, so these I pick up off of Amazon.com. And I have a variety of gadgets in this little bag. And... This is a little chip that fits inside any USB port and provides light. I have several different versions of this. Uh, let's see, this one is a color changing LED. It goes about six or eight colors. Which is good if you're going to be, you know, outdoors and trying to be stealthy. Which, at my job, I sometimes have to do. And the other one I use a lot at work is this. Which has actually got an on-off switch on the back. It gets very bright. And it is also dimmable. Okay. Now... At home, I take fairy lights that you can get that also work in a USB port. And I keep battery banks. I've got like probably eight of these at home. Um, I also have this thing. If you've seen any of my videos from my, from my apartment, you've probably seen Chinese lanterns hanging in the background. I'm a big fan of Chinese paper lanterns. And one of the things I've done for one of them, I've got a big one that sits on top of my projector all, all the time. That's, that's a tome. And inside that, I have a regular battery bank with a string of fairy lights wrapped around it, kind of, you know, semi-permanently. And at night, on my days off, when I want a little mood lighting, I will plug that in and, you know, recharge it on my days when I'm working. And then at home, I'll plug this thing in and hang it inside the lamp, and that'll run for about 36 hours straight. Um, I also have another battery bank. It's uh, what are they? this is 2600 mAh. The other one I've got is 10,000 mAh that I use like daily daily and that's got two strings of fairy lights on it and that's kind of run around into a a uh, what the hell candle holders good thing of the word so one goes in one candle holder the other goes in the other candle holder and uh, if i plug that in and turn those both on those will run for 48 hours if i just do one it will almost run for five days um at home i have another backpack that's basically for you know, my, my camping slash shit hit the fan backpack and in it, I have a larger solar battery power bank. And I keep fairy lights and another little bag with these things in it. 
So in answer to the question, are you prepared? What would you use if the lights went out right now? Honestly, these are the, the, the absolute best things I can think of because A, they're rechargeable, which a lot of the things you find on Amazon are not. A lot of the lanterns you find for camping are not. Um, if you're using a solar power backup, that's even better. Um, but uh, yeah, so there you go. The answer to your question.